It's your boy T Man, right back at it, right back in the attic for another day. This battle rap. You know what? I'm gonna just start it right off with Yo CG and, and Charlie Clips. You know what I'm saying? Cause we we've been talking about that battle. We think it's gonna be fire. We think it's gonna be dope. I'm really looking forward to seeing it just because I look at this as a a relaxing battle to watch. Something where you can expect some comedy. You can expect, you know, some thought bars, you know, and and that's always a, a plus for entertainment. Let's just be honest with each other. You know what I'm saying? Um, Yoshi G, you know what I mean? What else can I say about her? She's been working hard. She's been working hard. I've been following her. She's been working hard. Her promo is, is pretty good. You know what I mean? She got, um, she got something different to talk about that people just not accustomed to in this battle. Not even just the battle rap world, just the way she looks at looks at things in a way that she don't care really too much about what people think about her and things like that. Um, yeah, sometimes she can get emotional and she do get in her feelings when people say certain things. So I shouldn't say that she don't care what people think about her. But what I think is when she actually getting that bag, because it's been times where I done caught her like, oh, she don't care about nothing. Nobody thinking about her. You know what I'm saying? She going to keep doing her. When she in that bag, man, I'm telling you, man, she's dangerous. You know, then when she get to thinking too much and trying to do too much of this and do too much of that, you know, she's not as dangerous. So what it boiled down to to me is all she need to do is just stay in her bag, stay in her um, comfort zone for this battle. But think outside the box and, and do do a few things differently as well. You know, you're going to have to startle, startle charlie clips like he's gonna have to be like oh whoa 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 whoa! i wasn't expecting to have to rebuttal this now he's talented so i didn't seen him rebuttal so much it's crazy you know what i'm saying but yeah i think yoshi g she gonna have to bring herself her her best self to this battle and she's gonna have to have some rebuttals if not like three or four or five type rebuttals like she's gonna have to really really get out of her comfort zone for this battle now that I think about it, not be in her comfort zone. She needs to get out of her comfort zone for this battle. And I think that's going to help her. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if those bars, though, going to work against Clips, though. That's the problem. I don't know if it, if, if, if the thought bars work against Clips. So we we shall see. You know what I'm saying? Um, if we're going to talk about Charlie Clips, Charlie Clips, he should, he should win this battle. You know what I'm saying? I think Charlie Clips, as the number one known battle rapper in the world, you know what I'm saying? In the world. So if he's the top battle rapper in the world, you know what I'm saying? Why should he be worrying about little old Yoshi G? But let's see. You know, you never really know. But I'm just thinking like, man, this guy has passed Arsenal up in that. And Arsenal been holding that down for years. You know what I'm saying? But Charlie Clips, is he has been battling. He has been outside. And he has been making noise. He's hes definitely um, on Wild and Out. So, you know what I'm saying? That's going to also help with what he got going on, what he's trying to do in this battle rap world to build his name up, to be like a household name, worldwide A-list celebrity. Like, he's one of them guys that got potential to be there. You know what I mean? And it comes from battle rap, which is really cool, man. It's dope to see. You know what I'm saying? Um... But like I was saying earlier, you know, sex sales, that's your CG, you know, sex sales, you know, then you got comedy, comedy sales. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? Like we all like laughing. We all like jokes. We all like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna say all of us. Some of us is corny as hell, stick up our ass, don't know what the hell we want to do in life, but we want to be mad all day, people. Uh, people like that, I'm not talking about. I'm talking about the people that's sitting up here enjoying life. You know, you like comedy and you love sex. Let's just call it what it is, you know? So um, with all that being said, we'll see. We'll see what happened with this battle between OCG and Charlie Clips. Me, personally, I got Clips 3-0. I respect, I respect... Yo, CG, and I think she's very good, and I think she's a dynamic, great artist, and I think she's gonna go far in this battle rap thing, and 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 battling a legend like Charlie Clips only helps. Now you can be Lou Castro, you can get thirty. Like I feel like Lou Castro got thirty, and with that thirty, I basically feel like hey, he got thirty, but he fought, and it was a good battle. It wasn't like one of them thirties you look at and be like, this ain't got no replay value. That battle has replay value. I, I don't mind looking at that again. Matter of fact, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take another peek at it.
because I think it was a good battle. And then as far as OCG, I think she can make her 3 0, her, her 0 3 loss to uh, Clips is going to pretty much be replay value as well. She's great. She's going to do good, but she's just not going to be able to mess with Charlie Clips. In my opinion, this could change. Hopefully, um, it doesn't because I'm going for the fellas in the king versus queens. You know what I'm saying? Even though I respect the women and I do a lot of women blogs and that's what I came in the game with the focus on. It's like I'm going to focus on these women because, you know what I'm saying? What do don't like for one women and then they talented and can rap, man. That's great. Like what? <laughs> Anyways, man. Let's transition to the next battle. The next battle that I'm going to talk about, you know, I don't know the order. We definitely know Yoshi G and Charlie Clips going to be towards the end, but um, Fines versus Shuni. Now, y'all all know I'm from Cleveland. Y'all all know I've been covering Fines since day one. So we're going we gonna to definitely um, still be real, though. We're not just going to sit up here and just say, hey, Fines going 30, shoot, no Shuni. No, I mean... Listen, Shuni's a beast. You know what I'm saying? But I think people sleeping on Fines, though. Fines is a monster, man. Like, he's a punchline guy. Like, he's going to give you those punchlines. And listen, it's all up to you how you, how you, how you can, how your chin work. Do you got one of those chins like Rocky? You know what I mean? You got to have a chin like that to go up against Fines because he punching. Shuni, she's dangerous. Ooh, she's so dangerous. She's dangerous, y'all. Listen, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if Shuni snuck a victory here. But guess what? I'm not going for Shuni. I don't believe she's going to get it. But I, I I respect her. You know what I'm saying? But y'all got to stop sleeping on fines. But um, both of these battlers bring the punches. They bring the punchlines. You know what I mean? Now, listen. It's not going to be easy for either one of them because let's listen. When I'm talking about punchlines, I don't mean just no ordinary punchline. I mean, they be having haymakers. Haymakers. Both of these. Both of these two. Shuni and Fines. Haymakers. Room shakers. Things that you look back at and be like, all right, did she, did she just say that? Or did he just say that? Like, Crazy, crazy stuff. I think this only going to help their stock rise up even more. Shuni been around a little bit longer. I mean, Fonz been doing it for a while, but he was more underground. He's been in the um, scene as far as a major battle rapper for the last couple of years. And, I mean, let's just be honest, man. He hasn't been letting me down. He's been he's been fired. You know what I'm saying? I respect Fonz and everything he's doing for Cleveland because we, we light, lightweight on the um, battle rap scene. But we got some, we got some hitters, though. And we're going to talk about that one day. I'm going to have a blog one day where I sit up and talk about the the, the hitters from, from the city. You know what I'm saying? For Cleveland, that's doing their thing, man. Um, Yeah, this going to be a, this gonna be some firepower. Y'all going to love this Shuni and Fines battle. Mark my words, man. Come back to Top Flow and tell. Let me know like what y'all think about this battle when it's over with, man. When you get a chance, you know what I'm saying? Like and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate everybody that do that. It only take two seconds to do so. Check out the website, top uh, 216topflow.com. You know what I'm saying? Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, all of that good stuff, man. It's your boy, t Man, right back at it. Right back in the attic for another day of this battle rap shit. 100.